After a roadway shutdown in Elk Grove could affect your driving for the next several days, live pictures for you from the area right now. Union Pacific is conducting major repairs to its railroad tracks in Old Town on Elk Grove Boulevard. Elk Grove Boulevard between First and School Streets will be closed until Friday. CBS 13's Ron Jones is in Elk Grove. He's getting answers on how this closure is affecting more than just commuters, but also small business owners as well. Well, this is a major thoroughfare for a lot of folks trying to make their way into Old Town in El Grove. A lot of businesses are affected because of the lack of customers. Old Town, known for narrow two-lane El Grove Boulevard and limited sidewalks and parking, is getting squeezed even more. City leaders say the Union Pacific Railroad needs urgent repairs to its crossing, making the road between First and School Streets impassable. Drivers are forced to find detours, while some business owners are hard pressed to bring in even loyal customers. So now shutting it down is has been pretty quiet around here today. But loud with heavy equipment. <laughs> Historically, old town business owners have struggled to lure new customers here. This is not helping. So we fight every day for customers because of the way the parking is in Old Town, um, the way they had structured the street to barely any be any parking on the street. Um, that's the first time I've been here where they closed down the street for this many days, so I'm not exactly sure how the business is going to go. Right in the middle of the dust, noise, and negativity is Dave's Barbershop. Dave says this is the price of doing business in these tight old town spaces. The businesses within here are mostly like smaller family owned businesses and stuff, so we all talk to each other and they, we all knew it was coming up. City officials say this stretch of Elk Grove Boulevard is expected to reopen by this Friday. Now, CBS 13 photojournalist James Taylor is out driving in the region and he joins us now live. James, what are you seeing? Yeah, here's a live look at the detour. You can see uh, traffic is, is moving fairly smoothly. It backs up at some of the stoplights, but uh, once you get going, uh, it may be a little heavier than normal, but uh, not too bad. There are signs on each side of this three-mile detour warning drivers ahead of time about these road closures. Now, people trying to get through are told to use Elk Grove Florin Road on the west and Waterman Road on the east to go north up to Bond Road and then cut over and come back down. Uh, so once again, uh, no major backups yet, although the evening commute is still just kind of getting started. Uh, and uh, this closure is expected to last through Thursday. Another closure is expected to go into effect next month on Elk Grove Florin and Bond Roads. So be warned of that. Back to you. All right, James, thank you very much.